October 20th looks going to be a very packed day for video games. You have Spider-Man 2 coming out, a new Mario game coming out, which we talked about already, but we haven't talked about the new Sonic game yet. Which, I am sorry I didn't talk about the new Sonic game yet, but they released a new Sonic game called Sonic Superstars. I actually think I did talk about the Sonic Superstars, but I didn't really talk about it in depth, you know, as well. Sonic Superstars has so far had, like, is gonna have, like, free trailers so far, mostly so in the same stuff, but Sonic Superstars works pretty great for a new Sonic game. They're bringing back the Sonic classic gameplay they all know and love from classic Sonic games as well. It could be basically, it's basically gonna be Sonic Mania with more modern and updated graphics. Basically, it's Sonic Mania with a new art style. I really like this art style. It looks pretty good. And also, there's no Green Hill Zone this time for the hundredth time. Finally having unique worlds in Sonic. I'm glad that Sega... Oh, wait. Is that, is that Green Hill Zone? Come on, Sega. Move past Green Hill Zone for once. Oh, I don't think that's Green Hill Zone. But I like the new areas and new level designs in the Sonic Superstars. Also, they have a multiplayer mode in the game. So, if you actually have friends, unlike me, you can actually play Sonic Superstars multiplayer as well. And I think it's both co-op and online, I believe. And also, you'll be fighting Eggman and all of his robots trying to take over the world. And Sonic trying to stop Eggman from taking all the animals and putting them into, like, cages and stuff. Where's our robots and stuff. Overall, Sonic Superstars... Uses the same physics and engine and ideas as Sonic Superstar, as Sonic Mania, but now they're up there for a fresh new world. So overall, Sonic Superstars looks like a pretty good Sonic game. And that's it about this video here. Goodbye.